Today I want to walk you through replacing the acrylic on the Connect KSD6 dome port. When you order the replacement kit, it comes with a replacement o-ring, soft cloth, and a new piece of acrylic. The tools you're going to need, most importantly, are a table vise, clean toothbrush, some electrical or duct tape, toothpick, and some plastic cleaner. We like to use the Novus One, seems to work really well. There may be some other products that work just as good, but this is the stuff that we use. So the first thing that you're going to do is take some of the electrical tape and line the edge of the table vise. I've already done so, so you can see it's protected here. And the reason we do that is to protect the edge of the backing plate so that it doesn't get damaged. Then the next thing you're going to do is align these two edges with the table vise. Slightly tighten it just so that it's firm and it doesn't wiggle. It doesn't have to be over tightened or you're going to damage it. Next thing you do is you grasp firmly applying pressure around the full circumference of the ring and rotate counterclockwise. This may require some effort. I pre-loosened mine for the sake of time on the video. If you need help, go and ask somebody who's strong or got big hands. Once you loosen it, it comes off fairly easily. Take the retaining ring, set it off to the side, remove your damaged acrylic. You can actually see some pretty big scratches on this one. It was bitten by a shark. This was Jarrett Lau's dome. Now you take your replacement acrylic, some of the spray cleaner, clean the interior very well. Utilize your toothpick while holding firmly on the retaining ring. Remove the O-ring. Clean the backing plate, the O-ring channel. My O-ring is still in good shape. It's not damaged, so I'm actually going to use the same one that was on there. Take your new acrylic, place it evenly on top of the O-ring. Take your retaining ring, rotate it smoothly and slowly to make sure that it's not cross-threaded. Once it goes down evenly, you do the same thing but in a clockwise manner and tighten very firmly. Short, even rotations like this seem to work really well. And you want to keep rotating until you can't do it any more. About as much pressure as you're capable of putting on there. To make sure that you've done it right, you kind of want to check and make sure that the O-ring, I'm sorry, the uh, retaining ring and the backing plate are level. There you have it. You just replaced the acrylic on your Connect KSD6 dome port. Go out there and get some shots.